Oh, Lord. Hi, lovelies, and today I'm here uh, to do an unboxing of, um, Ipsy. Actually, it's a bagging, an unbagging of Ipsy. Um, first of all, I wanted to let you know that I kind of did things a little differently this time. Um... I decided to, since I got my bag so late, I decided to go ahead and try some of the products. Well, try all the products. And I have to tell you that when I first got my package, I wasn't too happy. Um, I got my package and it was just disheveled. It looked like it had just been thrown together. And so, you know, some of the stuff was out of the bag and just in the, you know, the shipping bag. And it was just, I don't know, I wasn't too happy when I got it. So I decided, I don't know how to, you know, I don't know how to do a bad review on some of this stuff. So what I was going to do was I was going to try the products and just talk about the products, basically. So now that I'm done talking about the, the problem with the shipping, let's get on to some of the products. The first one, I was so excited when I saw it. Um... Because I have never tried the Tarte um, brand before, and I I wanted to, but it's kind of pricey, you know. So I just was like, eh, I can't see spending, you know, thirty three dollars on a little, you know, makeup product. But I got one to try in my Ipsy bag. I got this, and it is the Smooth Operator, and what it says here is it is. Amazonian clay finishing powder. I tried it. I have it on right now. And oh my god, I love it. It is to die for. I, I have to say that this product would be worth spending the $33 to get another one. Most definitely. Also in my bag, I got a makeup brush. This one right here. Um, I don't know how to pronounce the name. It's a uh, bowl gar ga cheesy cheeses. I don't know. I know I said that wrong, but um, and it's this contour brush right here. It feels really lovely and very soft. So this this little brush right here is um had a $12 value. And then, oh my god, this cream right here, this one from um, Peter Lamas, is to die for. Let me tell you, the scent on this alone, the scent on this alone is amazing. The product itself is... Um, about a $20 value, $19, something like that. Um, yeah, but it says here, Spa Sensation Intense Repair Hand Cream. And let me tell you, my skin is very dry and very, very sensitive. When I put this on, my hands were no longer scaly, dry, or looking like a 90-year-old lady. <laughs> I My skin looks fabulous with this stuff on I'm telling you as a matter of fact I'm going to reapply some right now and I can show you what this looks like also so this cream it comes out kind of thick you know kind of Vaseline-y kind of sort of but once you start putting it on and it thins out a little bit and it's oh god it smells so good Anyway, so that's that, and that's what my hands look like after they're totally immersed in this wonderful stuff. So that's another product that I would definitely, you know, repurchase. Um, then I got this right here. This, uh, uh... <laughs> Another French one I don't know how to pronounce. Caudalie uh, Vino Source. 
Serum SOS Quenching Serum. And oh my god. You apply this one morning and night. It tells you to apply it before you put your foundation on. So you put this on and it kind of like smooths everything out. And then you put your foundation on and oh my god your face is like silk. Amazing. And the last thing. I do. I have tried the Pacifica brand before. And I like the texture of it. Let me tell you this one here. I don't know. I'm not too fond of the smell, actually. Um, ugh, doesn't want to come out of the box. This is the only one that I didn't try on. I couldn't get past the smell, actually. Oh. Very plasticky and oh my goodness. But it says it's 100% um, vegan and it's um, about a um, $16 value for this. And it's cruelty free and supposed to be totally organic and all of that. Now, um, I have tried this before. When you look at what the ingredients are that are in it, everything is on the up and up. They are. Very good. As far as the smell, I don't know. And the color of this one looks like that right there. So it is a very pretty color, you know, for like a lip gloss or something like that. But, um,. If you can get past the smell. Anyway, that's what came in my Ipsy bag. Okay. <laughs> um, so I have to say that I'm very pleased with everything that came out of my Ipsy bag. Even though in the beginning I wasn't too happy on the way I found it. Um, but I'm happy with the products. The products are amazing. Alright, thank you, bye, and oh yes, remember to like, subscribe, and comment below. I still have those bags that I'm trying to give away, and um, so if you like, subscribe, and comment, I can get you your bag of freebies, and um, that's all for right now. I will be seeing you later. Please tell me, let me know how you like these videos and what you want to see more of or what you want to see, you know, what you want to see happen here on this channel. And um, that's it. I'll talk to you later. Bye.